And from Joe's live shot in Tonopah, we now go to Orco. As the earthquake was felt by many here in southern Nevada, it is now raising questions if a similar size quake could rock the valley anytime soon. And we continue our team coverage with Orco Mana with those answers. Orco. Well, Brian, no damage has been reported here in Las Vegas, but people across southern Nevada felt the quake. There are about a half dozen active faults here in the valley and including here along Decatur Boulevard and you can tell that the ground is uneven in this area. Now here's a map of some of the other fault lines. Nevada is the nation's third most seismically active state behind only California and Alaska. This morning's earthquake outside Tonopah is the largest in the state since a 6.8 magnitude quake nearly 70 years ago in 1954. That's according to the Nevada Division of Emergency Management and the last major quake with the epicenter in Nevada was a 6.0 magnitude quake in the small town of Wells in 2008. Experts anticipate a 6.0 to 6.5 magnitude earthquake could happen in the Las Vegas Valley. They say we need to be prepared. Meanwhile, one woman in Pahrump says she was taken by surprise. I was having a really good dream, and then all of a sudden, my bed started shaking, and it was going back and forth and back and forth. I was got scared. I didn't know what it was, and I, I woke up, and it was still moving. I think it can be considered uh, an indicator that we need to be prepared for earthquakes in our region, that it, it's in a not-too-populated area. It caused some damage to the highway and things like that, but it, had it been right under a town or something, it could have caused a lot more damage. Experts say an earthquake in Las Vegas could cause damage to infrastructure, but they point out that building codes in Clark County have been updated to increase seismic safety in terms of how to prepare. You can bolt taller furniture to the ground, and you can also have three days' worth of water and medicine available to you. Reporting live in Las Vegas tonight, Orca Mana, 8 News Now.